How did a small simulator game based off an 80s family pizza restaurant become a global sensation? We unbox the construction sets from Five Nights at Freddy's. In 2013, indie developer Scott Cawthon created a game called Chipper and Sons Lumber Company, where a young beaver sets out in the woods to do odd jobs and collect wood for his father, Chipper. Feedback quickly came out with players saying that the beaver was very creepy looking and seemed to resemble that of an animatronic robot. Scott decided to take the feedback and run with it, taking the idea of animatronics from a family pizza restaurant and what happens when the doors close at night. From that, Five Nights at Freddy's was born. The game puts the player in the shoes of the new night watchman of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a fictional pizza chain based on Chuck E. Cheese. Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, and Foxy, the animatronic attractions, are a delight to children during operating hours, but when the lights go out, the terror begins. The world of Five Nights at Freddy's is rich and mysterious, and the fan base is hungry to discover all of its hidden secrets. The series spans now several games, spin-offs, novels, and even toys. In 2016, McFarland Toys released its first in a series of construction sets based on the game. These sets are building toys that feature multiple parts that have to be put together piece by piece. The success of these sets made the release of new additional sets every year, including four different sizes, micro, small, medium, and large. Let's check out some of the newest construction sets, starting with the micro sets of Series 6. And because the pieces are so tiny, we're going to get help from some of our younger friends with smaller hands. This set contains 39 pieces and is a buildable diorama of the Parts and Services minigame from Five Nights at Freddy's VR. It also includes a buildable Freddy Fazbear figure, which features a removable bib piece that will reveal his internal endoskeleton. The Corn Maze Micro Set is from the Spooky Halloween DLC Curse of Dreadbear. The Corn Maze Set includes 39 pieces for full assembly and includes a buildable Grim Foxy figure. The Salvage Room Micro Set is a buildable diorama of the Salvage Room from Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator. It includes 32 pieces and a buildable Molten Freddy figure. Up next, let's check out some of the small construction sets. Improve your Foz rating with a buildable diorama of the Star Curtain stage right out of the best-selling Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator, one of the games in the Five Nights at Freddy's franchise. The Star Curtain stage small construction set includes 72 pieces for full assembly, along with a buildable lefty figure, as well as movable paper curtains. Now we head to the upper vent repair. As a certified vent technician, you should need no instructions for this buildable diorama of the upper vent repair, based on the minigame Vent Repair from the best-selling Five Nights at Freddy's VR Help Wanted. The set includes 88 pieces for full assembly, along with a buildable mangle figure. Now let's jump back to the parts and services department for the medium construction set. Tucked away and out of sight in Freddy Fazbear's Pizza lies the part and service room, a dark and ominous location. It's here where spare parts and broken animatronics are located. Players must stay alert when monitoring this location as Foxy and Freddy are known to stalk the area. This set contains 209 pieces and comes with the withered Foxy and Shadow Freddy figures. And finally, the largest set of Series 6, the Deluxe Concert Stage. This is the best stage money can buy when building your own pizzeria. A buildable diorama of the Deluxe Concert Stage from the best-selling Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator, another game in Five Nights at Freddy's franchise. The large construction set includes 223 pieces for full assembly and includes a buildable Rockstar Freddy, Rockstar Chica, and Rockstar Bonnie minifigures. All of these sets are available now on Toyshnip.com, as well as other great toys from the popular game, including plushies and action figures from Funko. Now, I don't know about you, but I've had enough creepiness for one day, and now that these sets are built, I'm a little worried what might happen once the lights go out. So, I'm gonna get out of here. Ah! Don't forget, hit the subscribe button and ring the bell so you don't miss out on more fun content from Toyshnip.com. We wanna thank Noah and Henry for their helping hands building these sets. See you next time.